an electrocardiogram or ECG is a representation of the electrical activity of the heart recorded from electrodes that are placed on the surface of the skin. The electrical activity of the heart is based on two processes that take place in the cardiac muscle cells, depolarization and repolarization. Most of the cells in our body are negatively charged on the inside. Depolarization is a change within the cell's electric charge, resulting in less negative charge inside the cell. Repolarization is the process that follows depolarization and changes the cell's electric charge back to negative. In a standard 12-lead ECG, 10 electrodes are placed on the patient's skin, 4 of them on the limbs and 6 of them on the chest wall. One of the four electrodes on the limbs, the one attached to the right leg, is an earth electrode that helps minimize the artifacts so it doesn't record the electrical activity. The other three electrodes are attached to the right arm, left arm and left leg. Three unipolar leads and three bipolar leads are obtained from these three electrodes which look at the heart from different angles. In bipolar leads, the electrical activity of the heart is recorded between two of the three electrodes on the limbs. The best way to understand the limb leads is using Eindhoven's triangle. The bipolar limb leads are Lead 1 between right arm and left arm Lead 2 between right arm and left leg and Lead 3 between left arm and left leg. The unipolar limb leads use only one electrode. These leads are AVR lead. The electrode is attached to the right arm. AVL lead. The electrode is attached to the left arm. AVF lead. The electrode is attached to the left leg. The limb leads see the heart in a vertical plane. Leads 1 and AVL look at the lateral wall of the left ventricle. Leads 2, 3 and AVF look at the inferior wall of the heart. Six more unipolar leads are obtained from the six electrodes that are placed on the chest wall. Those electrodes are V1 attached to the right side of the sternum in the fourth intercostal space. V2, attached to the left side of the sternum in the fourth intercostal space. V3, midway between V2 and V4. V4, midclavicular line in the fifth intercostal space. V5, anterior axillary line in the fifth intercostal space. V6, mid-axillary line in the fifth intercostal space. The chest leads see the heart in an horizontal plane. Leads V1 and V2 look at the anterior wall of the heart. Lead V3 looks at the interventricular septum Lead 4 looks at the apex and leads V5 and V6 look at the lateral wall of the left ventricle.